Good evening, everyone. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, 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 microphone. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> Just nudging my microphone around. Ah, hello. How are we all doing? Happy Friday, everyone. This is the day I'm supposed to be streaming. Ignore last night. Last night was wonderful. Uh, <laughs> it was... We were more just there for the hype. It was really, really fun. It was I, it's the first time in a while that I played a game as it launched, and it was amazing, and it was wonderful, and it was so exciting, and so hype, and so fun, and I made it about an hour and a bit in, and then I was like, oh, right, I, I need to go start some graphic issues. Um, so we ended the stream there, and it was nice. That was a good place, um, and I can missed it. Don't worry, Flicky, you didn't miss a single thing. It was... Um, <laughs> interesting to say the least and i have uploaded it to youtube i've broken my um tradition I, ha I save all of the um recordings of all of the streams um and i am trying to slowly upload them to youtube just so i can have them somewhere as a nice backlog it feels it feels good then i can basically look at a giant list and playlists and stuff and just be like yeah i did all those i've spent this much time doing it <laughs> So much time I've spent doing this. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Let's not think about that, actually. Um, but yeah, I, I've been trying to progress um, through the old uploads. I'm like half a year behind at this point, but I broke my rule of um, doing it in order and I uploaded last night's stream last night. Or rather, I made it, I uploaded it, but I made it public this morning. I needed to change a few things and put a few warnings on it because, dear god, the flashing lights. Anyhow, <laughs> the good news is my graphics card isn't dead. I just need to update some drivers, because I forgot that you actually need to update your drivers, apparently, these days. Who knew? I, I, they were very out of date. Well, let's not talk about that. <laughs> ah, but we're here. Drivers are updated. BGM is a tootling. To tootling? Tootling. There's the, anyhow, it's wonderful stuff. Sorry, yeah, the usual stuff. If you've been here before, you've heard them before. They're wonderful, they're cool, I like them a lot. I like the music a lot, right? Shall we play the game? There we go. Old ring time. Hell yeah, it's Elden Ring time, everyone. There's a jellyfish. <laughs> Instantly a jellyfish. Hang on, let's uh, get that. Yeah, that's the wrong button. Get that hood onto auto mode. Normally I have it turned on to full in Souls like games, but for this game, auto mode works really, really well. It feels nice and clean. Hello, jellyfish. Look at it. It's friendly. Well, it's neutral. Do you want to see what happens if you attack it? I know you don't, but I know you also do, right? <laughs> it's so pretty. Hi, friend. Hi. Hi. Oh, it's so fucking good to have a Souls game where you can jump. Like, oh god, they did it with Sekiro as well. You have a double jump, and then and then now we have Elden Ring where it's like, yeah, you can just jump. There's a jump button. You don't have to sprint and then press down the analog stick and you will leap off in whatever random direction the game decides is appropriate look at him go hell yeah we are the bouncy this is the character this is sunstone obviously they're called sunstone are we shocked by that we are not oh, excuse me i thought they'd do a loop instead we just that's and an, <clears throat> anyhow <laughs> ignore the fact that i just upskirted my character two seconds i need to plug in my headphones they have booped at me therefore they are low on battery um, they are a confessor. That's the class we are, technically. Um, we're using... Um, oh, what are they called? It's it's miracles, but I can't remember what miracles are called in this game. Um, certainly called something. I'll, I'll give you that. <laughs> incantations? Yeah, incantations. Uh, magical spells. But apparently incantations also encapsulates fire spells, which I'm very excited about. Hell yeah. Anyhow, let's anger a jellyfish. Oh shit, <laughs> this is one unhappy jellyfish. Yeah, they go bright red. They're so pretty. Um, fun fact, I didn't actually know that they uh, were on this island. We are on an island, by the way. Uh, here's the map. Here's us. Oh, hello. Um, oh, look at that fucking view. God, it's so pretty. All the stuff glowing in the... It's pretty. Look at the trees, they're dancing. <laughs> The trees are very animated. I don't... It's it's delightful. It doesn't look like it should be that windy, but they are having a bop. They are having an absolute dancing time. Good for them, honestly. Good for them. Oh, dear. Hello, Sunstone. Sunstone says hello to you, too. Hang on. Wait, fuck. Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Uh, uh, uh. 
Uh. Uh. Ta da! <laughs> Delightful. That was worth it, wasn't it? Ah, oh, wonderful stuff. God, this game's gorgeous. And this is on the lowest settings, by the way. I have to have it on lowest settings because, I'm going to be honest, I'm a little bit... My graphics card is a little bit... Um, it's just below the minimum requirements. The minimum suggested requirements. So, um, yeah. But, it, it, do you know what? It's running really, really well. And it looks gorgeous on the lowest settings. So, who am I to complain, eh? Who am I to complain? Bunny Boy gives us a stutter hug. Thank you, Bunny Boy. It is very appreciated. That's not the best angle, darling. That's it. <laughs> It's very appreciated. Boop. This is what uh, they look like without their hat. Ooh, yes, wonderful. I really enjoyed the character customization. I spent literally half an hour doing it. Um, I will say I wish there was more hairstyles, but here's the thing. I will spend 90% of my time wearing a hood, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> It'll make a lick of difference. Oh, dear. But yeah, this game has a day-night cycle. And I did not realize different enemies spawn at different times. But I have never seen a jellyfish on this island. And then I came here, and it was nighttime, and a jellyfish was here. And I was like, oh, shit. We get some moonlight jellies over here. How delightful. Anyhow. Anyhow. I'm wittering. We have a thing to do today. Oh, but first, let me show you this church. Slash temple. Slash whatever the fuck this is. Hello. Hello. Is this a dragon? It's a Durgan. It's the Church of Dragon Communion. And I can apparently offer up dragon hearts to get some spells. They're all incantations, so it's all stuff that I'm aiming towards. Exciting. However, what the fuck is a dragon heart? Where do I obtain one? I can't wait to find out. Because then I can breathe fire like a dragon. <laughs> this game has dragons. I'm so happy. Ah, <laughs> is a dragon? Is a dragon? Yeah. <laughs> Anyhow, we're not here for the dragon. Uh, this is the map. It's so pretty. Uh, the map originally looked like this. This sort of... Uh, um, it, you've got the outline of the land, you've got a few little vague marks where the paths are and stuff. It looked like this, and I was like, oh, yeah, that's pretty cool. That's, it's, it's the first Souls game with a fucking map like this. You know, it's <laughs> amazing. And then I got an item that coloured in a set area, and look at this. You've got so much pretty stuff. Oh, it's so good. I love it. I love it. And there's more map over here that I haven't coloured in. And here's the thing. It zooms out this far. So I've got to assume that there is more map to be had somewhere along the lines. It definitely would be a very small game if this was the entire size of the game. This 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 one square that we have here. Um, so I'm almost certain that there will be loads more map. <laughs> I just have yet to explore it. Oh, dear. I've got to this. Um, this is the furthest uh, save point I've reached so far. I haven't gone through... You're supposed to... Here's the thing. These are our bonfires. They are called Sites of Grace? Question mark. And the ones that have little lines on them are pointing you in the direction of progression, which I think is cute. It's basically... These ones are normal ones, and these ones are the main ones that are like, oh, we're pointing you, you the way you should probably go. So go there, go there, go to here, go through here, all the way up here, go up to this one, go here, kill a boss, oh, look, we're in a castle. It's this big, terrifying castle. I'm just progressing through it. It's my favorite area so far. I love it so much. I accidentally skipped it, though. <laughs> I went up here, and there's this broken bridge. And I was like, ah, right, so we've got to go through the castle to get around it, right? There's actually a really narrow little cliff path that goes all the way around here to here. So it turns out I think you can skip the castle. I don't know if that's fully intentional. I, well, I presume it is. But I don't know if there's something you need from the castle. But you can just walk all the way around it, which is delightful. Um, it's so fucking open. This game's gorgeous. Anyhow, first things first. What we're doing today, I think I found a boss. I think I found another boss. There are a lot of bosses in this game. I think I found another one. Ask Rathion on a date. That's how you get a dragon hat. I mean, you're not wrong. Hey, look, here's the thing. If I see a dragon, you're right. The first thing I should do is ask them on a date. Then if they're violent, then we can murder them for their heart. But you're right, that's the ethical way to obtain a dragon's heart. Is to befriend them and seduce them. Then you get their heart. Not in the gory way. Gory way is the second option that we're very much considering, if necessary. But let's let's hope for the delightful part first. <laughs> Anyhow, I found some catacombs. Let's go over to them. Ah, oh, wonderful. I fucking... I'm so in love with this game. I'm so in love with this game. I'm not the biggest, biggest, biggest fan in the world of open world... Uh, survival crafty things, and this isn't survival other than the fact that enemies hit you and you take damage and you die. Um, 
but we have a crafting system and I really like it. I actually really like it, which is unusual. I'm not the biggest fan of crafting systems. Um, and it's so open. The world is so open. I will say my favorite area so far is this castle where it, it feels really classic Dark Soulsy. It feels really classically from soft, like it's all windy and narrow and there's loads of bits that loop back on themselves and little narrow corridors and knights everywhere and shortcuts and ah, it's really good. I'm loving the castle so far. Um, but all of this area has been gorgeous too. Very, very open. I've spent a good time just running around doing nothing. It's been great. <laughs> it's been great. All right, so here's our bonfire, or, or as they are known, Sight of Grace, where we can pass the time or we can just sit and have a, have a sit. So these are some catacombs. They are delightful. I had a wonderful romp through here just before stream. Um, it's really, really fun. Basically like a little mini dungeon thing off to the side. Really well designed. I loved it. I loved it. You went down here. There was a bit where you look back on yourselves. There's loads of these. What's the? There's the one. There's loads of these horrible little statues that come to life and start attacking you. It's great. I loved it. And it has unlocked this delightful door here, which um leads to a fog wall. Oh no, we found a boss. Shall we Shall we attempt said boss? I haven't actually said hello to it yet. Don't know what kind of boss it is. Might not be something we could actually do. I'm definitely going to give it my best go. Um, give it a few attempts and then probably give up and go back to the castle and then get intimidated by the castle. I'm just going to pop back to the, um, the grace real quick. I keep calling them bonfires. I am trying to adapt to this game's language and be like, no, they're not bonfires. This is not Dark Souls. This is Elden Ring. It is a sight of grace. But bonfire... It's a lot easier to say than Sight of Grace. I'm going to quickly uh, allocate my flasks so I can go. I've got full health and no mana. We don't need mana flasks. I probably won't end up using mana flasks too much. I will need health health flasks more often. My finger out. Oh no, Flicky, what's wrong? <gasps> Open pistachio shells to eat notes, but I had cut my nails so I didn't have a lot of grip. Oh no, hooded fingy. <gasps> Flicky, no. Evil pistachios. Eat them as an act of revenge. That'll make you feel better. <laughs> Alrighty. I think the sound was decent on last stream. I haven't changed anything since then, I don't think, but the, the usual stuff, let me know if it's too quiet, too loud, blah, 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 blah. Um, I will say, delightfully, in the sound settings, we have the usual... Oh, I haven't got any music turned on. Fucking hell, what am I doing? Why have I got the game music turned on? Uh, we have music, we have sound effects and voice, the usual stuff, but there's also a master volume slider, which is really nice. So if it's just a bit too loud or a bit too quiet, instead of having to fiddle with individual bits, we could just bump up or down. Just wanted a mouthful of nuts. Is that so much to ask for? It's not too much to ask for. You're right. How dare. How absolutely bloody dare. Right. Oh no, it's going to be a big one of those statues, isn't it? Erd Tree Burial Watchdog. <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me? We have a floating statue. And I don't mean a statue that's come to life. I mean a statue that moves like a statue. What the fuck? Oh my god, I love it. Doggo, yeah. I mean, here's the thing. If I had not been given a name, I would definitely say cat, but it is a watchdog. So, fuck it. It is a doggo. You're not wrong there. Hello. You're beautiful. Look at the way it moves. Those animations are so It's just... A, it's a statue. It's not like, oh, it was standing still, and then it, it came to life, and now it's moving like a thing. No, no. This is a fucking statue. Wow. <laughs> ah! It hurts like a statue too. Oh, bloody hell. Let's get some distance quick. Oh god, it's doing fire times. Look, I can do fire times too. We can be fire friends. How about that? <laughs> Hello. Yoink. Oh, maybe I should have got more mana stuff. This fire spell's really hot. I mean, very literally. But... Oh shit, are we gonna... Are we one shotting this boss? Wow. I fucking love that. Oh, wow, I love that. See, we are fairly close to the start of the game in this area, so fair enough, that wasn't the hardest boss in the world. That was really pretty, though. Holy shit, love the almost stop motion it has. Yeah, that's so fucking good. How they used to do movies in the older days, yeah. Oh, I love it. We also got some noble sorcerer ashes. Mm -hmm. Well, that was delightful. That was absolutely delightful. Also, these are some Erd tree roots, apparently. Cool. Why is it always fingers? Ooh, corpses. Let's return to... Oh, visions of chaos. Hell yeah. <laughs> visions of chaos. Because it's like the branches from... Bed of chaos from Dark Souls 1. I think I know too many... 
too many things about Dark Souls these days. Return to entrance. So yeah, these these wonderful little like side dungeon areas basically that don't they're not there to further anything. They're just little side things, and you can teleport back to the entrance at the end. I fucking love them. They're so good. Hello, hello, Adam. Where are the lines at? The lines have been banished far, far away. I needed to update my graphics drivers. I have done that. The lines vanished as soon as I did that. I was the problem. <laughs> You'll be glad to know. All right, so we got a new thing. And for the life of me, I... Was it Noble Sorcerer? Oh, shit, we got... Okay, so these things called Ashes, where in certain areas, there'll be an icon on our left that looks like a little spooky gate. I guess, uh, where we can, um, what's the word? Summon allies, summon little friends. So I'm, I'm tending to summon a big, I've got a jellyfish summon, which I really like because it's a jellyfish <laughs> and I love it. But now we've unlocked a noble sorcerer, sorcerer spirit. That's hot as fuck. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, it was that we got, wasn't it? It wasn't any of the weird other things. There's so many things in this game, but I, I'm really starting to understand them. Oh, I did upgrade an item today. I haven't tested it out. I had a fa a fa 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 fal falchion, fa mm -hmm. one of these things, um, and I made it a magic. Uh, but I also that made made it have an ability where I can make it spin. I need some. I need some magic juice. Hang on, let's go sit down and get some magic juice. Let's get ourselves some magic juice real quick, and then I think we're gonna head towards the castle, which I'm so excited for. I love the castle. Uh, flask charges, a bit of magic plus. Thank you. Much appreciated. Right. Oh dear. I hope this works how I think it's going to work. Spitty sword. Go. <laughs> yep. That's amazing. Look at that. <laughs> oh yeah. What does that do exactly? Not a fucking clue. But it looks gorgeous, doesn't it? Um, lifts armament in the midair and make it spins violently. Those it touches will suffer successive attacks. Should we try and blast someone with it and see what it does? How long have you played this already? All day, but here's the thing. Not like... I still feel like I'm very much in the first major area. I don't... I'm not progressing through this at a fast rate. I'm just having a fun time running around and doing nothing. It's so much fun. Alright, I found out how to dual wield things, which is so good. <laughs> I'm a magical blender, fear me. <laughs> okay, well that's wonderful. I'm gonna put broadsword back on, but I'm glad I have that as an option. So if anyone's weak to magic damage, they're gonna get blended. Oh, amazing. Nice. Hell yeah, it's so good. All right, should we go to the castle? Go on then. Tell you what, I'll show you the castle from, from a walking up point of view, so you can see the view. It's majestic. It's sort of got this weird, uh, I don't know what the words they used are, it's sort of got like a, a rotting vibe to it almost. Look at this thing, Storm Veil vale Castle. Looks pretty fucking stormy. I'll give it that. I'll give it that. There was a boss on this bridge. I killed it. With the help of a jellyfish. <laughs> also a sorcerer. There was a, an NPC I could summon, so I did. Ah, this place is so cool. But yeah, it's got like these giant tears in the wall that are like, some of them have like weird goopy bits on it which is the only way i can describe it like they've got like rotten goopy bits on it <laughs> that look kind of like branches almost i'll find one and show it to you in a second um where do we want to head off to at ah, the cliffside that'll have some in view up to yeah yeah but yeah the first main area has been really big and really open and really wonderful and i've loved it it's been great there it is, this sort of weird goopy stuff here. It's sort of like gnarled branches and also rot. It's interesting. I like it. I can't wait to figure out what on earth it is. I like it. Let's head further in. Rampart Tower. This is as far as I've got so far. Oh, I love it in here. I love it. Yeah, no, the first area, really fun, really big, really open. Loved it. However, I've got to the castle now and it's so good. It's very, very classic Dark Souls in here. It's very classic Dark Souls. You've got narrow edges. You've got an entire fucking... This area over here was so cool. You can jump up there and go around there and go around here and climb up there and get an item. And oh my god. There was... This entire section over here was just... Oh, well, I fell to my death. <laughs> There's a platform down there. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, dear. But yeah, there was this whole section where you can go climbing on the rooftops and get items. It was so fun to explore. 
I really, I, I like the open areas. I like the big open star bit, but this is my favorite area so far. Big old castle with narrow windy bits and weird arrangements and platforms and shortcuts. And I'll get my runes back. Thank you. Also, this game has made me hate birds. Friends of the castles you show on Steam. Yeah, on stream even. Uh, yeah, it definitely has that vibe. It's so good. Wait a second. Hang on. <laughs> my God, they made that castle in Minecraft. Holy shit. <laughs> Okay, so this is a bird. The birds in this game are evil, apparently. They throw explosives at you. I killed that one, so it didn't, but I'll let the next one lob its explosives at me because it's terrifying. Hi. <laughs> Fuck you, bird. They also have, like, knives attached to their talons. Ow. That was mean. Oh, God, I drank the wrong flask. Now I'm healing magic stuff. <laughs> They've got knives on their talons. They put knives on a bird. We put knives on a fucking bird. It's it's very dangerous out here. I don't like it. I love it. I don't like it, but I love it. <laughs> Anyhow, let's sit down and try and do that properly, shall we? Ah, <sighs> plot twist: Elden Ring is actually Minecraft Dungeons RTX. Oh shit, RTX is powerful. <laughs> I mean, it is, but here's the thing: it definitely isn't because uh, my graphics card is not RTX compatible in any way whatsoever, <laughs> and never will be. My good old 1050. Bless it. It's done me really well. I'm really proud of it. I dread the day I have to upgrade it because, dear God, graphics cards are expensive these days. All right, let's lob this air bird. I have a delightful fire spell. It's my new favorite thing, I'm going to be honest. All right, let's crouch. Crouch. Oh, what have we got? What have we got? Stormhawk feathers. Thank you very much. Yoink. Oop. Smack a barrel on the way down. Yoink. Oh, no. I got too close. Fuck. Oh, no. I want to try that again. 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 <laughs> oh, dear me. I am the worst at being like, no, no, that first bit didn't go right, so we'll start again. I don't want to waste all my flasks, which is a silly attitude to have, but hey, hey. Hey to the hoe. Same. Oh, do we have the same graphics card? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. It's a good one. It's done me really well. That missed entirely. It's a bit embarrassing. We're not going to talk about that. <laughs> Never miss the bird. That's terrifying. All right. So I think this thing has longer range than I think it does. I should be able to lob it from like here and hit it. If not, it'll, yeah, hit the barrel and the barrel explodes. Nice. These dark barrels full of explosives. Also, fun fact, I can hit this thing through this. Okay. When the bird doesn't take off, I can actually lob things through this tree. Oh, God. There's a pillar in the way now. Never mind. Oh, fuck. Hello. Where did you come from? Jesus. If I manage to not get the attention of that bird, where it's sat and where I am here, I can lob it through there. It's a nice little gap, which is delightful. Ah, oh, wonderful. Right, let's crack on. Lots of things to do. Let's pop some mana back up. Ah, oh, wonderful. So I've got a bow and arrow in this game. And it's really good. Also, there's a bell here. Hello. It's really, really useful. Which is... Um, unusual, I'm gonna be honest, <laughs> for, a, for a FromSoft game. Bow and arrows aren't, aren't always the best. Um, they're not always the most useful. They tend to be pretty uh, average at best. But, but it's really good in this game. All right, I'm, I'm finding it really good. I'm finding it really useful. I've got some burning arrows, which are very fun. Can you get up here? Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't notice there was a lot of that. Oh, all right. Now we're going to find out how much falling damage enemies can take. This is fun. Oh, I can hit them on ladders. That's a good start. Oh, God, I nearly took falling damage there. Oh, no. Not gone how I wanted it to. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> all right. Knights are dangerous. <laughs> he's, got, oh, he's got a mini. Oh, okay. So the knight helmet had like a mini dragon on top of it. It was really pretty. I liked it. I want it. I wish to have a, a little helmet with a little dragon on. That sounds amazing. All right, we'll try again. Lob. Really? I genuinely did not know that I could miss. That's interesting as fuck. I've never had that miss before. That's so fun. If you could call it fun. Lob. Pop. There we go. Bird took off just a bit too late. Yeah, so we just be really sneaky here. And then, oh my god, it woke up as soon as I started casting. What a bugger. What a bugger. Oh, well. Lob. Oh, no. Knife time. Who gave birds knives? Honestly. Very rude of you. Whoever you were. Whoever, indeed. Right. 
I do want a dragon helm. It's so cute looking. I want it. I need it. I must have it. Add it to the collection. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear me. I'm really glad that there's dragons in this game. Really, really glad. It was me. You gave them knives. You made them too dangerous. I smarted me and took them from my kitchen. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Well, it wasn't your fault in that case. The birds, they're, they, 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 they snuck it, snuck the knives away. Pop. Ooh, right in the back of the neck. You poor thing. Is what I would say if you weren't an enemy in a video game. Have you just... Oh, no, you have... Co I thought he'd come on his own for a second then. I was so excited. And uh, let's dual wield. And then, and then, and then just smack you as soon as we see you. Pop. There we go. Fuck you. Oh, please can we hit you off the ladder as well? <sighs> no, no such luck. All right, you're doing scary things. Yoi. Oh, no. Okay. And pop. Pop. Ow. Get stamped. Get stamped. Fall off an edge. Fall off an edge. Fall off an... Oh, damn it. <laughs> There's a little roof down there we can fall onto. I did not get the chance. I did not get the chance. These knights are dangerous. Should I be here? I feel like I have... Well, I have other places I could go, but like, I don't know. I feel like I'm in the right place. Also, I don't know what that is, but it appears to be a giant walking bell tower. We're not going to question it. <laughs> I've seen some terrifying things on these loading screens, and I hope I never have to see them uh, in the game. Just kidding, I can't wait. Lob. How is that missing? <laughs> How is that missing? Well, I aimed at the wrong bird then. Let's just, let's, uh, this was never meant to be. Should we go somewhere else? These are the routes we could take. Fuck it, let's go other ways. Other places. Um, actually, I think there's a fog wall I have access to. There's a big lift here that takes us way down to the bottom, where there's a scary, scary knight. And I'm going to be honest, he's very scary. I don't want to go near him. I can't kill a normal light. No, no, a scary one. Alrighty, where does this one take us then? I can hear remember. Hello. <laughs> oh, God, this thing. Fucking hell. Right. <laughs> I have zero currency, which is good because I'm gonna... Oh, God. So when you first start the game, um, you're thrown into an area, and it's one of those boss fights that you're supposed to lose. You die against the first boss. It's presented to you straight away with no tutorial, and you're like, oh, God, what is this terrifying thing? And it kills you, and then you get lobbed into... Oh, why didn't you need... You get lobbed into the actual starting area. You know, it's just a sort of a weird intimidating thing. Anyhow, this is the same thing that that first boss was. Or it looks the same. It's this weird... I do not fucking know what. However, it delightfully seems unable to be able to get through this um, little barrier. <laughs> this wall seems to be... Or well, this doorway even seems to be small for the little thing. And I'm not going to complain about that. Shame about the absolutely trash damage I'm doing to it, though. But what are you going to do, eh? What are you going to do? It likes bows and arrows. Should we find out? Oh, it doesn't. But then again, it also likes hitting me. So it's... Uh... Um, do that, do that, there we go. Ooh, Grivalicious, right. Hello. <laughs> oh, yeah, heal again, that's what I meant to do. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you walking away? Oh, why have you got a face? I don't like that you have a face. Is that your face? Is that someone else's face? <laughs> why do you move like a crab? Ugh. <laughs> Are you trying to dodge my arrows? Much dislike for you, I'm going to be honest. I have much dislike for this enemy. It can get it a bit. It's big and wiggly. The good news is I did make a load of arrows before stream. Because I was kind of running out of them. And they're kind of very useful these days. Come on. There we go. Right in the noggin. Oof. You didn't like that one at all. Oh, God. Where have you gone? There you go. Hello. What are you doing? There we go. So how's everyone's day? I'm killing something very slowly. The coward's way, you could say. I would agree. I am a coward. <laughs> but I'm an, I am hopefully an alive coward. That's that's the deal we're going for here. Cowardice at, 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 the, at, the, at the reward of you will be alive. <laughs> Come on now. Folio, please, weird crab humanoid amalgamation we do not want to talk about. Your shoulder appears to be impenetrable. Oh no. Boink. Come on. Couple more shots. You're nearly there, darling. You're nearly there. It was good. Work was messy. I had D&D for five hours afterwards. Heavens above. That sounds amazing and wonderful. 
I do not know how you have the energy for that. That sounds amazing, though. Five hours, blimey. Also, fuck you with that thing. Whew. That will not be a one-time kill. I, I fear. I fear that will be a... Oh, what is that painting? Up. Uh-huh. Was that thing supposed to drop down? Who can say? All I know is there's a big painting. Hello. Seek Lord. I think that's the Lord of the Castle. Something gives me that inclination anyhow. Highland Axe. Fun. I'll never use that, but fun. <laughs> oh, God, look at this area. Yeah, D&D sounds really, really fun, but five hours, blimey. I would never have the energy for that. I'm glad that you do, though. That's wonderful. Area through there. It looks like we can get up, get up onto all of these rafter bits as well. Good Lord. Goodness gracious me. This is but a busy area. I can see you all the way up there. Should we get you first? One at a time, please, because you might ring your trumpet and bring all your friends. There we go. They tend to do that, which is a bit annoying. <laughs> Those evil trumpeteers, dastardly buggers. Oh, dear me. Very exhausting since I get into it. Uh, voice acting in such for five hours with your friends. Blimey, yeah, that does sound whew, very fun. Um, yeah, don't see them for a week because I just can't. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> I honestly would be the same, if not more. <laughs> I'd be like, all right, I'm going to be gone for like a month now, but it was a wonderful time. Glad we did it. I'll see you later. Hello. These things for firebombs, which is... Oh, <laughs> that was not a firebomb. That was what appears to be some sort of bowl with food in it. Delightful, delightful. Let's deal with the other two quietly. Point. Or one of them quietly and the other one a bit quickly instead. Ow. <laughs> you can't just throw pottery at me. It's very rude. Nice little bowl of something. All right, what we got here? What we got here? What we got here? Exalted flesh. No, I do not want to know what that is. Thank you, game. Thank you for the exalted flesh. I will ignore it. Oh, God, hello. How long have you been there, darling? I do apologize for my um, ignorance of you. Plunk. Plunk. Saucy. Why did I say saucy? Why is that the word of choice? Time for ranged battle. Oh, uh, did you mean the big thing down there? Yeah. I'm pretty sure there are like five. You can approach most of these areas from either direction. So a lot of the... Oh, God, there's a thing there. Let's ignore that. Hello. Um, oh, there's a doorway. Is it locked off? It is from this side. Hello? Can I shoot you through here? No, but I can set the invisible <laughs> bars on fire. Delightful. You'll love to see it. We are having a bit of a nap, aren't you? I can bet how we get through there. I'm going to get a drink quick. <sighs> Sneaky's jaws. Yeah, this is this is real sneaky times. We have a crouch button. There are stealth mechanics. There's a big bad scary eye. <sighs> there, there is a legitimate pathway in um, a stealth playthrough, and I did, did enjoy that to no end. That's not what I meant to do. There we go. <laughs> Uh, that one there. Good stuff. I'm slowly learning how to... They've changed a few of the little um, things around how you um, dual-wield weapons or two-hand weapons. It's slightly different. What's your patrol? You go all the way over there. Can I sneak up behind that table and get around you? I think I can. I think I can. I have a spell that's called uh, Assassin's Approach, which means I take a reduced fall damage. Not the most useful, but I'm also silent. Very useful. I make no noise. I am the sneakiest of the straws. I still crouch, though, because it makes me feel good. God, there's a chest there. Oh, you're going to square. Oh, I wonder if I can open that real quick. Fuck it, fuck it. Go, 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 go. Open, 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 open. Mimic's veil. Cool. Don't know what the fuck it is. Don't care. I am out of here. <laughs> you don't see me. Oh, my God. He doesn't see me. How did that work? Oh. Oh, it's one of those giants. Oh, no. Those things are enemies. But that one's dead and appears to be feeding some evil dogs. Gross. I love it. <laughs> Glad it exists. Ah, that's the other side of that doorway. Mm. Hello? Is there a knight in here as well? No, we're just on the top of these rafters. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. 
god, this is such a good area. This entire castle is fucking good. It's so scary as well, though. Like, the knights are terrifying. It, it, oh. It's very good vibes. It's very good vibes. I'm enjoying it immensely. Favorite area so far. There's only been two, but favorite area so far, you know? <laughs> Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> All right, what we got? Time for revenge. Oh, God, is the big thing down. Yeah, okay. So let's see if you want to. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I like that. There's a corpse over there. <laughs> One of many. Um, How do we get over there, though? Can we get over there? We must be able to in some way. We'll have to go through this door first, though. Oh, this is so fun. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Ooh. Oh, yeah, this is going to loop around. This must do. Those white ghosts, by the way, there are other players. Or oh, there are uh, th things that other players have done. They're not necessarily in real time, but it's it's sort of like, oh, yes, someone ran here and did this thing. It's uh, it's the vague multiplayer-ness of Dark Souls that you can have on or off. <laughs> or from soft games, I should, I should say. Golden room. Saucy. What was that item we got a minute ago? What was in the chest? It was a it was a thingy thing, wasn't it? A thingy thing. Let's have a look. Mimics fail. That was it. Uses FP to mimic nearby objects. Oh shit! Reusable. Wait. Reusable? When you say reusable, do you mean like? Ah oh, shit! So not consumable. Wait, really? Have we just got? Does that work? I'm going to keybind it and we'll see if that works. When I say keybind it, I mean put it on here. If that's like... Because there's items... Let's just... Because there's items like this where it's a neutralizing thingy. It cures poison on you. It's a consumable. It says consumable under its name. We go down to the Mimic's Veil. It says reusable. Daggers are consumable. They're consumable. Fragments are consumable. That's consumable. Yep, 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 yep. Telescope is reusable. That makes sense. It's reusable. Really? That's so cool. I wonder if we can move when we do that. Is that going to be like camouflage? I think we fuck around and we find out. <laughs> yes! Oh my god, I have camouflage. I have camouflage. This is so... This is so <laughs> oh my god, and that's reusable? Oh my fucking god. So there's a spell in... in, in like that thing from the other one. Yeah, it's there's a spell in Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 called Camouflage. Oh, no, it's called Chameleon. That's it. Um, and you turn into an object in that that's like local to that area. So if you're in an area with a load of like altars and stuff, you might become like a bit of an altar or a chair in an altar. Anyhow, um, 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 but that's like an intelligence spell that you need to cast. But this in this game, it's just a fucking item. I don't need to take up a spell slot. Oh no, we're down here. Oh no, we're down here. Okay, so do you remember that night and that person we were fighting and we gave up on? And that's the roof we were on up there. Yeah, we've we've looped. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I wonder how we get to that other side then. Heavens. Visions of friend. Aww. If only I had a friend. Ah, plump sort. Yeah. I love seeing all the little like all these messages are left by other people that are like referencing all the fucking Souls games. Like, there's a fireplace in Irithyll in Dark Souls 3 where um, Onion Man sits down in front of it and he's really nice and really lovely. That's what that's talking about. <laughs> I wonder how effective that. Um, can we jump over here, by the way? No. No, we sadly cannot. Oh, I broke the crates and all. I wonder how effective that camouflage is then. I also wonder how far along those walk. I think we follow these people down. I think we follow these people down, run up onto the rooftops, and uh, make a plan from there. I would really love to see how effective um, the camouflage is. How useful the Mimic's Fail is. If they will walk past it. If they will aggro us still, I want to see how good it is. I also don't want to risk dying. Um, so, you know, it's a nice balance we've got to make here, but we'll do what we can. Okay, let's activate it now. Uh, we're gonna... <laughs> what are we? Oh shit, we're a tree. <laughs> Sorry, we're a bit of shrubbery. Okay, hang on, we walk, we, we move quite slow on my shrubbery. As you would expect from a uh, sh shrubbery. Go, 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 go. 
go, 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 go. Up, up, up. No, fuck you. You can't see me. I'm on a ladder. Fuck, they've seen me. Oh, no. No, put the sword away. You saw nothing. I am but an illusion. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. <laughs> Why did that work? Okay, so we go back down and around. Yeah, no, that sounds good. Descend. Yeah, it worked. How did that work? Oh, it's just this area here. Okay, so that doesn't link up to that area over here then. Ooh, how do we get over there? So many places, so many things to figure out. So many dead bodies to attack because they're actually evil. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, yeah. We, re we really are the sneakiest in this game. It's delightful. This is a fun place where you can talk to this magic person and learn things. Oh, hello there. Good to see you safe. Hello, I forgot your name. To learn a battle art or two, right? I'd love to. Sorcerer uh, Rogier. That's it. Ah, uh, yeah. So uh, he sold me the thing that lets me make my uh, magic weapon go spin, spin. <laughs> Wonderful. All right. So we can teleport back to there. And I think we will i think we will that's the fun thing in this game you can you can teleport back to any um fate site of fate um you're free of charge you do not need a homeward bone you don't need a consumable you can just open up the back and be like i want to go over here now and you just can it's great um there are certain times when you're like in a cave or in a dungeon where you're like oh, i can't travel in this area um but for the most part you can just zip all over the place it's wonderful all right so Ooh, let's get our bearings. Where are we, and what are we doing? In fact, let's get the uh, binoculars out, or the spyglass. So, there's this path along here with birds, with roofs, with that bit over there. We've discovered this, we've explored here, we've gone along here, wonderful stuff. Through that building, ah, and that's the roofs I've climbed on, yeah, okay. I've been on top of those roofs, and I've been in those buildings now. We want to get to this other side, then. Where there's what looks to be a swampy ruin. Which isn't my ideal choice of location, but quite frankly, it's where we haven't explored, so we should probably head in that direction. I reckon if we go on the rooftops, we can make it there. I reckon the rooftops will lead us there. I just need to remember how I got to the rooftops. that That's just what we need to do now. Um, let's go have a look then. Oh, was it the lever? No, this was the way we came back up. So how did I get onto the rooftops? I can't remember for a second. Can't remember for a second. Let's run up here and find out. What's going on up here? Oh, hello. I forgot you were here. Combat! Yeek. Boink. 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 There's a person with a crossbow behind us. We'll go run and say hello to them. Yeet. Ah, that's a scary jump. <laughs> I don't like that jump. But I also kind of love that jump. It's just a bit stressful, you know? There we go. Big old bonk. This is a big old elevator, which is very, very pretty. <laughs> Yeet. <laughs> Stressful. Oh, yes, it is through here. I remember now. Oh, you remember. This is how we got up to their rooftop cities. And... And sneak. <laughs> All right, almighty oh, silencing spell. I'm going to go say hello to a man in red. Because this man in red up here has a trumpet. If he blows the trumpet, he will awaken several enemies in this area. And I'd rather not have to fight them all at once. So let's go say hello to Trumpeteer. Say goodbye to Trumpeteer. <laughs> the good stuff. Right, no one else should wake up unless um, yeah, I smack them now. Oh, hello. You're there. Let's just pretend you don't exist. Uh, I think it's on this roof here, right? Oh, but that one. Oh, God, you're awake. Hello. Fuck. Okay, if I go near them, they wake up, which, fair enough. Makes sense. You're still quiet over there, though. Do you know what? Fair enough. You can sit in your corner. I'm not going to complain. All right, so... How I went about it first was going down to that wooden bit and then around on that goddess there. I wonder if we can sneak on these top bits. I want to fuck around and find out. I want to fuck around and find out. Ah, oh, this bit's so fun. I'm scaling fucking rooftops. Oh. <laughs> stealth. Yeah, it's stealth. I agree. <laughs> oh, heavens. So there's that bit just below us. It doesn't look like there's anything there. Empty battlements. Big old towers over there that have had a big bite taken out of them. <laughs> Enemy there. Some sandbags on a wall. Oh, there's that goopy bit. You know, the goopy bit. 
There's that body that was hanging there. So we walked across this nearby one or that far by one. No, the nearby one. That's the enemy we saw through the gate. Hmm, I see. Goop. Oh, no. <laughs> Flicky. When I said goop, I didn't mean troll goop. Okay, it's not. <laughs> this isn't this isn't King's Rest again. Although, I mean. <laughs> Alrighty. Bets on me being able to make this jump. Three, two, one. Yay! Hell yeah. I can actually jump in this game. I can actually jump in this game. It's so freaking good. A hiding place. This is a hiding place, to be fair. It's quite cozy, isn't it? Is there anything below it? Oh, an item I haven't got, so I haven't explored this area. Nice. Oh, look, there's smoke coming out of those chimneys. Do I want to know why there's smoke coming out of those chimneys? Should that worry me that there's smoke coming out of those chimneys? I don't think I've seen smoke in any other chimneys. Is that some sort of slaughterhouse? Oh, is that some sort of burning hell? Oh dear, I should actually maybe be concerned by that. That doesn't sound very fun. <laughs> okay, so there's these rooftops here. Fuck it, let's drop into this bit. I've not been here before. Gotta explore it, me. Gotta explore. I've got 2,000... Hey, a stone sword key. Oh, nice. So those are kind of like... Um, oh, <laughs> yes, just have a jump. Be wary of down. I agree, there's an enemy down there, I think. That's not one there. Oh, it's the fucking bird, isn't it? There's another bird up here. It's an evil bird, as opposed to those nice birds we've had so far. Oh shit, fucking bird. <laughs> no. This bird sets you on fire as well. Not with explosive barrels, just with apparently flames that it has. Ow. <laughs> All right. I forgot about the evil bird and then I fell on the evil bird. It's got some sort of leather mask. Oh, it's terrifying. Oh, dear me. Honestly, Dark Souls... Two. No, Dark Souls 1 made me scared of pigs. Dark Souls 2 is going to make me scared of horses when I get around to doing that part of the DLC. Um, and this game is making me scared of birds. Just birds. Birds are evil in this game. Good to know. Uh, but the, the unifying thing is that in all Souls games, dogs are evil. That's that's always. Dogs are all evil. Uh, sadly, also Sif, the dog, the great wolf, the beautiful baby. I didn't realize that I'd actually hit that attack, so I didn't do the attack I meant to. But the undead dogs in every Souls game are all evil and awful and the worst. And I hate them. <laughs> oh, sadly. Poor puppies. Poor little undead puppies. They didn't ask to be dead, but they are also very dead and very, very evil. So we'll deal with them when we do. Right. I haven't done my assassin spell. Pop it on. Say hello to Trumpeteer. Burr, burr, burr. No trumpets for your friend. I wonder if birds are fooled by mimicry. I wonder if a bird sees a moving statue or a moving tree and goes, yeah, it's about normal and just carries on with their day. I'm excited to find that, find a, a, a reason to put that to good use. And I'm really happy that I have it. Holy shit, I got chameleon. I got freaking chameleon. Got a mushroom as well. Lovely. Right. Uh, the bird was down there. Let's go say hello to it. Uh, let's go say hello to it the other way, actually. I think that gives us a more approachable angle to A, recover my uh, currency. My runes. Uh... <laughs> Bless you. Uh, I can recover my runes easier and also... Do you think we can attack it from here? I've not actually killed this bird before. I went on these rooftops and explored it. I aggro that bird. I ran away from it to over here. It fell off the edge. Couldn't get back up despite the wings it had. Went inside that building. Got trapped in the building. I just left it there and ran away. Um, <laughs> it was a weird experience. The bird was like, what? I, what? I can't. I can't fly up. I'm a bird. It was like, yeah, huh? you're a bird, darling. You don't seem to have the concept of upwardsnessness. Can you get up here? You can't. Oh, even though you have wings and you are technically a flying enemy, you do have some sort of groundedness. That's really interesting. That's something I can take advantage of. <laughs> Please don't prove me wrong now and just yeet yourself at me. I would cry. I would cry. Don't try and fucking hide. You <laughs> You can't see me. I'm a bird. I know I can see <laughs> Look at its weird face. I mean it's not. It's it's got like a weird leather mask on it. It's not It's not what its face normally looks like, but dear god. I've got like so many arrows just shooting at this thing. It's flittering around. Come on. I'm I will do this the hard and the slow way. Don't don't you underestimate me. Alright, let's just let it flit around. I'm gonna get a drink. Yes, yeah, so runes are our currency. Runes are our souls. We use them to buy things. We get them from selling things. We use them to level up. Ah, oh, look at this. We're so fucking cool. 
What kind of... <laughs> what kind of evil stealthy cleric? Oh, oh no, don't hide that. Can I hit your wing? Kinda hope so. Kinda hope so. Like an evil person for hoping I can hit a bird's wing. But... Video games. Oh, come on. Don't make me come down there. I was gonna say because I will, but I kinda hope I don't have to. Well, I hit you, so I'll count that. <laughs> come on, do your flip-flaps. Go back to your hiding place. We've we've done the routine before, sweetie. Let's just skip to the end of it. C come on. Please. No, got to go all the way down there. All the way along there. Oh, we didn't. We went all this way there. Yay! Look at me hitting a thing in midair. So proud. So proud of that bird that I murdered. The poor thing. <laughs> the poor thing. Uh, let's put a little bit of a fall damage spell on and let's go for a jump oh i uh, forgot i was still casting a spell there but that's fine worked out okay got a feather got my coins back me runes um okay why were we wanting to be on this bridge again not a fucking clue not a fuck oh we're we just coming back for our what's the word our bits our bobs our bibbly bobs runes although actually if we go down here i don't think i've explored this side or have I? Maybe I haven't. This could potentially lead us to somewhere new. Actually, this does look like somewhere new. Strong foe ahead, therefore dashing through required ahead. Oh no. Okay, so the suggestion is just fucking peg it. Awesome. Awesome. No, nope, didn't mean to cast that spell. Very casual flying coming from a bird. It was. It was just uh, just gently flapping around while someone slowly but surely pelted it with fire arrows, and then it decided to give up. It's like the roof you fought that monster with the axe tail thingy. Oh, the gargoyles. Was it the um the did the ones that you can chop the tails off of and get them as a weapon, do you mean? The uh the bell gargoyles, belfry gargoyles even. They were definitely a thing in an area like this. Yeah, ah, nice. It does kind of, yeah, it does. Definitely got that vibe. Oh, it's you, it's spellcaster and a another person. What if I just jump over and around? What if I just Can I jump around corners in this game? Let's find out. Yay! Kind of. <laughs> Kind of. Not like especially, but kind of. All right, I don't think we've drawn attention. First off, head. What? What? Oh no, I found a spooky area. We found a spooky area. A real spooky area. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> okay, so do we go to spooky spooky hell times? Or do we try and fight these two, but with no range? Oh, we can just stealth past them, right? And if we if the stealth fails, here's the deal. Here's the deal. That's not what I meant to do. That's also not what I meant to do. Blue Nick. There we go. <gasps> okay, so plan number one. Stealth past them. If that goes wrong, jump down the hellhole. Run, run back here and jump down the hellhole. Hope they don't follow us. Bon appetit, right? Find out what goes on down there. Hopefully these two just leave us alone. They can't hear me. They're facing away from me. Hopefully there's not some AI trigger that makes them turn around at a certain point. Okay, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. There's a very open exposed bridge here. Hope they don't look over it. Supposed to have that with a cannon. There's several people down there with a cannon. Hello. You're an enemy. We're just going to have to deal with you. Okay, I can deal with you if there's just you. Nope, not if I do that. Okay. Bonk. Bonk. Nice. All right. I just really hope those two over there stay over there and don't decide to aggro. I hope they don't decide to be like, mm, what's that noise? Like, you know, NPCs do. <laughs> Oh dear. Ooh, Nomadic Warriors Cookbook. That's more crafting recipes, that is. Let's find out what it was. Uh, number 10, wasn't it? Yeah, so it is <clears throat> Stormwing Bone Arrow. Oh shit, a new arrow. How do we make those then? Fletch with Stormhawk Feathers. Okay, so it's the same thin beast bones we need for the other ones, but the Stormhawk Feathers, that's that's for the um, from the birds up here. They do 55 damage instead of 35. Here's the thing. Firebone arrows do 100 damage, which is just better and easier than farming these birds. So that's good. <laughs> Glad to have the option. I'm not going to use it. Hell ahead. You're not bloody wrong. You're not bloody wrong. So do we go that way? Which is the area we were looking at initially. It's the weird swampy bit. Which, to be honest, if we can get on that roof or stay on these battlements and just, like, pick people off, I don't think that'll be too dangerous an area. I think it's sort of... It's messy and there's lots of people, but if we just stay out of range and just pick people off, we should be okay. There is, however, a ladder here. Let's go have a wander around here. Let's have a look around, shall we? Hello? Anybody through here? Oh, God, there's so much to this area. 
there's so many different like levels and layers and platforms and yeah and i love all of it oh yeah we go on the roof Ooh, was that a gap down there was that a really narrow gap yeah <laughs> hello don't mind me just saying hello to a narrow gap in a wall because i am exciting um Okay, so drop down, drop down, or take a ladder. We're going to drop down, drop down. But it's good to know the ladder's here to get back up, right? Yeah. I wonder if it's a ranged battle we can fight. Let's find out. Let's find out. Yee. Hello. This looks like some sort of... Aha, enemies. Good. <laughs> we jumped to the right battlement. Okie dokie. Hello, kids. How are we doing? Get popped, fool. Oh, you've got big axes. Oh, don't say you can climb ladders. Actually, if you can climb ladders, to be fair, I could probably, like, take a few pot shots at you while you're doing that. That might make my life a bit easier. It gives me a timer. I have to probably kill you before you do that. But it makes you an easy target. Look at you go. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm not even a bit sorry. Not even slightly sorry. Oh, a headshot as well. Look at me. Proper little sniper. Oh, you took that last part, last part of it jovially, my friend. You will regret that. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm not even slightly sorry. <laughs> Anyhow, uh, big enemy over there. How good's my range? Do I have that? Yeah, I've got the talisman that increases my bow range, but does it... <laughs> How much does it increase my bow range? Let's find out, shall we? Bit of an overshot. Still an overshot, blimey. Oh god, I missed that entirely. Straight to the side. Also kind of to the side. Really? Blimey. Not much drop off at all on these blooming things. All right, well, I'm going to deal with you the slow and painful way. Painful for you. Um, probably painful for my arrow count, but here's the deal. I do not care. I <laughs> I'd rather just spam you five times in a row than have to fight you in melee. And then when I eventually have to fight you in melee or I come across a boss that I have to fight in melee, I will be woefully unprepared for it. But you know what? That's okay. I'm okay with that. Oh, right in the head. He's walking so slowly, the poor thing. He's got a tiny dragon on his head as well. I want it. Give me your time. Oh, it's going backwards now. You got backwards. You got bored. He's like, <laughs> Learned the error of your ways, have you? Decided that it was a bad idea to fight me, the sniper. <laughs> That's the stupidest way I've killed an enemy, but also the safest. <laughs> so we've got that going. Oh, dear me. Exile herd. Saucy Walsy. What does that look like? Looks like a hood. It's apparently heavier than my Cler my confessor hood, though. So we're going to take that off. Oh, dear me. Stat-wise, when I'm leveling up, I'm not sure if I'm being the most efficient right now. I'm trying to dump a load into faith because, you know, I typically go with faith builds. It's what I do. Is this the... No, it isn't. Oh my god, there's so many of you all. Hello. Blooming egg, there's thousands of them. They've all got bows and guns, and they're all ranged. No, not guns. They haven't got guns. This is... <laughs> I don't think there are guns in this game. No! Ah! <laughs> Hello. Fuck. Wait, hang on, are you a... No, you're a knight. Let's go upstairs. Let's go upstairs. I don't want to fight you. No! <laughs> oh, thank you. If I jump onto this edge, are you gonna follow me? They're coming, they're coming. Yeet! Oh my god. Please don't follow me. I think we're okay. I think we might be okay. We're gonna have a quick scout over here. Uh, avoid the hole in the floor, and then we'll go back. Hello? Hello? Bit scary down here, isn't it? Oh, God, look at them all. Ah, that's that archer, that, that person there that was there. <laughs> you know, that person that was there and was there. All right, is safe? I think it is. I think we're safe. Can we get back onto that ledge? Fucking hope so. Yay, we can. Oh, thank goodness. Thank you, video game, for allowing me to run the fuck away. I now have a safe spot, and that's good. Question is, is that knight still there? And if so, we're going to have to deal with him in some way, aren't we? 
Where have you gone? Probably back to your spawn point, I'd imagine. Yeah, okay. Okay, no, this is fine. <laughs> Shall we test out the chameleon? <laughs> Shall. <laughs> Don't think it's a good idea, but I kind of want to. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put my assassin's approach on. Can you lure out with arrows? I probably can. I just, it's right behind that wall bit. Oh, crouching turns off the thingy. Fuck it, we're just going to crouch. It's behind this wall. And I can't hit it from what, wait, it was behind that. Is it still there? Where the fuck has it gone? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> tree, tree start. The tree start would have worked. Anything would have worked. We could have done nothing. Apparently he's not here. That scares me, because now I don't know where the fuck they are. Um. We potentially just have a rogue knight running around who wants to murder me. That's good. That means it worked. Hell yeah, it definitely worked. We turned into a tree and that scared them away. Festering bloody finger. Uh-huh. Is that a PvP thing? It is. Ah, it allows us to invade another player's world. Ha. No. Uh, no, we will not. Thank you. Thank you for the option game. Always nice to have. So where are we? That's not what I meant to do. Fuck it. We did what we did. Oh god. Nope, that's not the right button. There we go. <laughs> Any enemies down here? Well, no one stood up, so I'm guessing that's a no. Do 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 do. Where are we? Where are we? God, this castle just goes on and on. There's a downstairs -y bit. What the fuck is the downstairsy bit? Oh my word. This castle is relentlessly huge. I love it. It scares me. I love it. I will never have this place explored. I would love to. Here's the thing, I'm not going to. But at some point, once I'm content with my progression in the game, I, I want to look at a map. <laughs> when someone gets around to make it. Also, 10 hours, nice. I would absolutely die to see a map of this game at some point and see all the, a map of all the levels because some of them are... This is ridiculous. I mean, we obviously, we have a map, right? But, like, I can't make this... Yeah, but I would love to see, like, a wiki map, like a really... where all the items are and where all the shortcuts are and where all the... You know, I just, I'd love to see all the little weird details because this area is fucking huge. But also not huge. But also, what the fuck is that? Why is it just a puddle? Oh dear, that's the reservoir. So we put all the naughty people. Or we threaten to. Um, where are we? Oh, we're at the castle gates. Did I? Fun. As if we made it back here. That's so weird. Fuck it, let's use the map. So this is the, the bridge we walked up to. Them's the castle gates. We couldn't go through there because there was a, a bajillion archers, as you can see here. They've all got giant repeating crossbow things. Dear God, dear God, dear God. Um, so we went around this little side bit, walked along here, ba doo 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 Ah, oh, so that's that. That's, so that's where our bonfire is. So that bit along there is like the church with the sorcerer man. <clears throat> Sorry. Then that bit is the building-y bit in there. Is that the big, like, swampy goopy bit? Or is that the big swampy goopy bit? There was the big... There's a big fucking keep over there, apparently. Horrendous, terrifying. There's a road that leads up to that. Is that the road where there was the people at the top of that gate into that... Oh, God, I have no idea. But anyhow, there's the castle gates. And there is the big bridge that we uh, cannot cross because there's five different holes in it. But it's very pretty. And also, there's a thing at the end of it. So I definitely want to. Wait, no, we... Can we? I've got a horse. This game gives you a horse. Fun fact, the horse has double jump. Oh, so you see that little icon on the left of the screen there? That little, like, spooky-looking gateway with words on it? That means that we can summon our friends. We're not going to. I don't think I need to summon a jellyfish right now, but it's good to know that we can. Apparently that hit the wall in front of me. Let's not crouch, then. Crouching's bad. I'm interested to see um, if these crossbows can turn around. I don't suppose they can. They look fairly stationary. They're all pointed at the gate. I think that's very intentional. Fuck it, we're going to explore the gate area then. I'm okay with that. I would say that would make us a... Ha, ha, have We have had a successful travel if we have 
looped all the way around and explored the gate. I'm good with that. The gate's a terrifying area. Ah, so is that the bit where the bridge is then? Yeah, that's the bit where the bridge is. I wonder if we can get up there. I really hope so. I want to go run along the bridge on my mountain, try and double jump the gaps and fail miserably and then cry because, oh no, my runes are on the top of a giant bridge halfway across a fortress. You know, it's... Oh, they've got crossbows of their own. <laughs> got a giant crossbow, but also I have a personal crossbow in case things get intimate, you know? Go bless him. Right, are we going to eat down then? I think we shall. I think we shall. Yeet. Once we're down here, we have kind of committed to it. Can we use these? No. Can we break them? I think we can. Come on. Come on. Fucking break. Okay, maybe we can't break these. No, we can't break them. Buggers. The meanies. Oh, we can. <laughs> they just take 50 shots, apparently. Wonderful. Yeet. <laughs> That's, that, they're very resilient, but they do have an animation that sort of indicates breakability. Like, it, it does look like they're taking some sort of damage, right? There's wooden chips flying off. You just have to hit them 50 times. Fair enough. I don't think they're going to stay permanently dead. I definitely wish they would. They're not going to. That's okay. We just It just means we have to really try and clear out this entire area while we have it clear, you know? While we have no one here, we can snipe all the enemies, make it less dangerous deal with it from afar. And yes, there's no one up here, but fuck it, I'm gonna... Oh god, there's someone. Hello. Oh, it's you. How do you feel about dying? Yay nay. You're kind of nay on this fact. Um, I, can I convince you to yay? Yeah, I can. Nice. Boop. Dual wield. I love that I can summon my jellyfish here. Like, yeah, fuck it. Set the jellyfish loose in the courtyard. Be free, my friend! Do you know what? It's surprisingly tanky, and it stacks up like a poison debuff on people. It's really good. It's really good. It's a very good jellyfish. Smithing stone! Nice. That's my upgrade. No secret passage ahead. You're not wrong there, that's just a wall. Oh god, hello. Fucking hell. It's been a while since I've had to fight someone directly, not just sniping from afar. Do I remember how to play this game? <laughs> yes, I do. Nice. <laughs> the weapon skill for this weapon is so good. I can hold it in a poise, and then a light attack will break a shield with an upcut, or a um, heavy attack will do a long chargey thing that does so much damage. That thing can what one shot loads of enemies, but you have to. You're, you're fairly vulnerable in the whole situation, so you have to definitely take precautions. That person's fucking dead. That's the most dead body I ever. <laughs> Just flow. Just looks very tired, I'm gonna be honest. Poor thing. Alright, hello kids. I'd like to deal with you, please. Thank you. Don't blow your trumpet. I'll get angry. And you'll die. <laughs> no, no. Don't tell them that they're gonna die anyhow. That, that will ruin any threat I could possibly hold. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, put your weapon away. Those people died, but like the threat's probably gone. One shot? Nice. Hell oh, yeah, it's so nice. But it, it makes me fairly vulnerable. And I have to be decent at aiming, which, haha, it's a novel idea, right? Like, I have to make sure I am at a decent distance and I'm, like, properly charging it up and, you know, I'm gonna hit the enemy and not just land in front of them and then be vulnerable and then die. <laughs> it's happened before, basically. When we go into the courtyard, I think I'm gonna summon the jellyfish, just in case there's anyone hiding around any corners. It'll make me feel safe. Nice. I'm gonna get a drink quick. Whew. Alrighty, let's carry on. I think it's jellyfish time. Jellyfish? Oh. Wait, why can't I summon my jellyfish? I've got my little symbol up. <sighs> why can't we summon the jellyfish? Don't lie to me, video game. Have I misunderstood this? Oh, do I know? I don't have enough magic juice. Let's get the magic juice back up then. Jellyfish. Hell yeah. Hi, spirit jellyfish. You're my friend. It's so pretty. Also, I could use it as a torch. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> Poor thing. It probably would be a bit insulted if I said, I've summoned you to be a torch. Good day. That's not a hidden path. You're a lion. <laughs> Come along, spirit jellyfish. 
any enemies, I'll you I'll trust you to float towards them. Oh, ominously, and then and then uh, deal with them. Oh, god, there's like four people up there. Okay, jellyfish. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't I didn't realize there was actually enemies in this area. I thought we'd be okay. Okay, no, it's fine. I've got eight arrows. Oh no, I've got eighty-eight other arrows as well. These are all flame arrows, but you know, plenty of normal arrows. Oh, jellyfish, go! Jellyfish, go! <laughs> Hell yeah, get him, jellyfish! Poison the fuck out of him! Oh, uh oh, I ran out of uh, fire arrows. Normal arrows, it is. Uh oh, jellyfish! <laughs> Be careful, friend. Look at it, what a babe. You got this, thank you. I'll try my best. Whoops. I am still not 100% on figuring out where I need to hold um, items, but that's okay. Boink. Now, jellyfish, let the enemies get close before you start to attack them, please. We're not... You don't. I don't want you to run in there and then have to deal with five enemies. That's exactly what's happening, isn't it? Oh, good God. Jellyfish. Jellyfish, stay at range, please. Don't drag the enemies towards you. You can't deal with them and neither can I. Please, please stay back, sweetie. They're too dangerous for the likes of us. Throw poison from afar. That's all we That's all we need to do. You just throw off a few poison bombs. I need to dodge these blooming crossbows is what I need to do. You just throw off your... <laughs> They're all standing really confused in a circle. I think I'm a tad too far away for them to realize that it's me shooting them. Oh, God. They are shooting back at me. But they don't seem to want to come any closer. Or they don't seem to be able to come any closer. Which is... Very delightful. I'm a big fan of that. Oh, they're shooting my jellyfish. Which is a sentence I didn't think I'd ever say, but I'm really glad that I get to. I did not expect this game to have summonable jellyfish. I'm very, very happy that it has summonable jellyfish. I'm going to be honest, the jellyfish, po jellyfish poison does not seem to have stacked up properly yet. It hasn't, it hasn't unleashed its full potential. I used the jellyfish in uh, a very major boss fight, and it worked really well, because, you know, while I was whittling away at them, uh, eventually they stacked up a poison on the the boss and that just whittled the boss away as well and it worked really well in a big boss fight maybe for packs of small enemies i should consider different allies I, no offense jellyfish i'm not saying you're bad i'm saying you have specialized strengths for specific locations and perhaps a pack of wolves would have been more situational you know i have that as an option i have a sorcerer i have some generic enemies generic soldiers uh, i have a uh, pack of wolves Although, to be fair, jellyfish tanky as fuck. Look at that thing. It's just having a good time. Squidging out poison. Go, go, fucking go for it, jellyfish. To be fair, it's got quite short range. Maybe then, maybe it's not reaching them. Like, it's long range, but it's not... It doesn't look like it's fully reaching them, you know? God, my aim is so trash. I've wasted... I'm wasted. I've used pretty much all of my arrows on this outing. Um, so that's fun. <laughs> Gonna have to go buy some more. Jellyfish, you're a babe. You're a babe. Has anyone ever told you that? Probably not. You're a jellyfish. You weird, dude. Jellyfish is a heckin' cool. They really are, aren't they? They're so good. Blomp. Hi, friend. High five. <laughs> <laughs> Gooey. Oh, heavens right. Let's have an explore. Exile hood. Already got one of those. You need to wake up, aren't you? No, you're a corpse. That's awkward. I love the little purple glow that's just following me around. Hi, jellyfish. Are there any enemies nearby, my darling? Can you can you detect anything? Are we good? I think we're okay for now. Ah, oh, there's some up there. Nice. In the head. Get him, jellyfish. Get him. <laughs> Uh-oh. That one's getting close. Uh-oh. That one's getting close. Uh-oh. This is less of a ranged fight now. Oh, no. Ah! Die! Sheep! Okay, we have lost our range. We have lost our range. I repeat, we have lost our range. I have to play the game normally. <laughs> Fight? At a close distance? Do you think I am some sort of heathen? We spam arrows from afar like a proper... Um, what am I called again? I keep wanting to say missionary, but that's definitely not the right word. But I can't remember what the right word is. Oh, that's a dead person. This courtyard is looking pretty clear. Yeah, so this is the path that leads up to that other bit with the other arches. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I'm starting to understand how this bit works. A little bit. I'm getting there. Ooh, let's run around and get some items. This place looks pretty clear right now. Thank goodness. 
We got a lily. Very pretty, very pretty. I would love to unlock some sort of shortcut here. That would mean I would... I don't like you. Goodbye. What the fuck is that? 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 What the fuck is jellyfish? Oh, jellyfish. No. There appears to be some sort of wolf demon. I'm going now. Goodbye. Ah. What the fuck is that? Jellyfish, I promise I'm not throwing you to the um, theoretical or, in fact, literal dogs, but also fucking goodbye. Jeez. Oh, there's a bonfire here. Really? Shit, there's a bonfire. Oh, a grace. A pile of grace, whatever it's called. Lost grace. <laughs> pile of grace. Mm, that's definitely the word. Nice. Well, that'll do as a shortcut, to be fucking fair. Common as simple garb. So oh, lovely. Get some wooden bits. Hi, jellyfish. Uh, we still find the weird wolf thing. <gasps> what does this do? I want to find out. What does this do? Why can't I use it? That's a lever. I want to push it. <laughs> Maybe it opens the gate. That's already open. To be fair, it probably does that, doesn't it? Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, God, look at it. What is it? It's some sort of wolf thing with a blade tied to its foot. How effective is my arrow? Not especially, and I only have 23 of them now. I don't think I'm going to make that. I don't think that's doable, especially if I keep missing them. Bugger. Bugger. I'm out of flasks. I'm nearly out of arrows. I don't want to sit down and respawn this area, because that means having to deal with all of those enemies that we just obliterated and waste, spent all of those arrows on, you know? But I also don't want to just try and fight that thing, die, have a jellyfish. Why are you flashing? Oh, you're running out of time. Oh, goodbye. I'll see you later, friend. You were very helpful. Yeah, there we go. I just want that thing to de-aggro. I want it to run away and de-aggro. So I can go down there and get that item. Where's it gone? Get that item. <laughs> oh, why have you not... F what are you doing? What are you doing? It's time to run. It genuinely is, isn't it? That thing's terrifying. De-aggro, please. Jellyfish, what are we doing? I thought you despawned. I mean, you look like you're despawning, but do you want to get on with the despawning bit? <laughs> My friend. I'll miss it. I'll miss it, you know? It's a delightful friend. Go away. <laughs> Pl please? Okay. Strange. Um, oh, there's that guy down there. So that opens the gate. It looks like that thing's ran away, so I'm just going to go and get my um, item quick. Yeah. I feel safe. Ballista bolt. Well, fair enough. Oh, jellyfish has followed me. Likely are you ready. I'm not even slightly ready. I wonder if we can just make a beeline to that area and run past the dog and just... Have the dog. I'm calling it a dog. Dog's the right word. Um, Just run up to it and run past it and just see what it is, you know? Also, can I de summon? Yes, send summon spirit back to the beyond. I think I will. Goodbye, jellyfish. I miss you. You're a sweet pea, but uh, you're also very bright. And I'm thinking I might try and stealth this bit. I might use the rest of my um, remaining... Uh, <laughs> this is going to go so badly. The last bit of my mana to uh, try and stealth past this thing. thing is, if this goes wrong and I die, I am losing 5,700 um, coinies. And I don't especially want to do that, but the only way to deal with them would be to go and heal up and respawn everything and level up using those. And I don't really want to do that. Because <laughs> then I wouldn't be able to stealth past the, the, this thing. Oh, God. What's its stealth detection like? How good is it at seeing things? That thing can definitely outrun me and can definitely fucking murder me. You got this? I don't know that I do, but I appreciate the cool cheese to, to help. <laughs> Thank you for the good luck. I will need it. It might just leave me alone. I can't panic homeward, that's the thing. I can't panic and cast a spell to take me home. I can't bubble hearth, you know? I, I can teleport back to a thing, but not when I'm in combat. And I'm gonna be honest, that thing would definitely be in combat. We might just make it fucking hell. This is so stressful. Stay there. Stay there. 
Oh god. Oh god, they're gonna come to life, aren't they? They're gonna come to life. They're gonna come to life. We're going back. I'm aborting. <laughs> Those statues looked exactly like the enemies we'd seen before. Oh, they had the exact weapons. They, one of them was going to come to life. I am not in a situation to be dealing with that. Let's have a sit down. Whew, blimey. That was stressful. <laughs> Shall we level up? We've got enough things for it. Um, yeah, dexterity. Let's go health. Get some more health. I wouldn't say no to that. Goodness gracious, my throat's so dry. That was terrifying. I enjoyed it greatly. Oh, dear me. For all the, like, giant open spaces this game has, to then dive into something like this, no lever ahead. You're not wrong there. Behold, sorcery! Ha-ha! Yes, they opened it with sorcery. Um, yeah, for how open this game has been in parts, the, the small area, it's so, it's so fun and good how it can be so incredibly different in two areas. And, of course, those things are back to life. Good, 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 good. God, I really have to clear out that entire area just to get back through there again. I do not have the arrows for that. I am so out of arrows, it's not even funny. And I can't craft anymore, either. Okay, I need to go get some thin beast bones. Or just buy some from the vendor. But I only have 1,503 uh, runes. Actually, to be fair. Got plenty of rune consumables. Let's pop these and see what we've got. There we go. Bear to you, bear to you. Oh, there we go. Oh, dear me. Stressed. I was stressed. I was stressed. But I'm okay now. We're okay. We're fine. We're good. We're back. We're here. We're safe. Oh, actually, maybe nearly enough to level up again. Forget, let's do that first. <laughs> Give me the extra level. It's more important. More health or more endurance? Ah, endurance is stamina and equip load. I don't want to level up too many things at once. You know, I want to focus on one thing. My intelligence is low. My arcane is low. But I've got good faith. Decent, de good dexterity. Strength, endurance, and vigor, and mind are all weirdly similar. I can't decide, really. I have to go for a bit. I have to walk the doggy for I go to bed. Back as fast as I can be on my stream. Thank you for a good entertainment. Strength, Elder Ring. Well, thank you for being here, Vicky. It was delightful. Um, I don't know how much longer we'll be going, but um, yeah, thank you for stopping by. It was it was a lot of fun. Thank you, friend. Have have fun. Say hello to the doggo. <laughs> oh, what do we put it into? Hmm. Hmm. Um. Yeah, bigger. Okay, let's put more health. More health. It's the it's the coward's way out, but it's it's probably a good way out as well. I'm gonna bugger off to a vendor. Where's the church? Church of Ella. There's a person that sells arrows. I'm going to buy some. Oh, oh dear me! I'm yawning. Oh, I'm tired. Been a long day, it has. I said that I woke up at 11 o'clock. It's not been that long, you know. <laughs> uh, arrow! 89 of the boogers, please. Thank you. Arrows are expensive in this game. Blooming price of the arrow. I've got three rune bits left. Um, tab up back to the castle. So there's the main gate and there's the gate side chamber, which it's a really nice thing to unlock, actually. It's a really nice shortcut. Well, it's actually not. It takes us up to the slightly higher level, but it doesn't... It's literally just below where we were. This doesn't take us to anywhere new. Like, the outside bit here is just an item, I think. Oh. There is an area down there. No, but that's just the main gate. No, we've been there before. That's nothing, that's nothing new or exciting. I changed my mind. This is a really weird place to put a bonfire. I don't understand it. Like, there's one, literally. Right down there. You can see it just outside the gate. Like, I don't know. We The gate's open. We have the chance to open the gate, so we did, and, and now I don't... Ah, <laughs> uh, what are you going to do, eh? What are you going to do? I will say, there are there are some areas where it's been really strange how frequent um, the Sites of Grace have been, and then other places where there's just giant gaps. Like, this entire side, I explored all of this area over here, all of this area over here. Didn't find a single Site of Grace. Nearest one I could find was there or there. Not a single one over there. I mean, this is the starter area in, like, underground in dungeons, so fair enough, ignore that. But, like, this bit here. There's one there. You go through a path. There's one here. Fair enough. I understand this one because it's right before a boss. You do a boss. You get one for defeating the boss. You walk five seconds. You get one at the gate. 
and then now we've just discovered one just above the gate. Ow! All right, bit rude. <laughs> like, it's not a problem. It doesn't harm the game in any way. It just feels strange. It just feels a bit weird to me. I'm just like, why? Why have we got so many of these so close to each other for no apparent reason? Like, oh, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't, like I say, it doesn't harm the game in any way. It doesn't make things worse. It, it just makes me confused. I wish this one was a bit nicer. I wish we had some way of getting rid of all you lot. Alas, I don't know that we do. Hmm. Turning into onion night now. Hmm. Hmm. Let's go back to the tower. See, there was that big, ah, there was that big bit. You know, the big bit, the big swampy bit, as I keep calling it so lovingly. Um. So there's the rooftops. There's all big swampers. That's that roof we were on over there. So that's that bit over there, and then over there is over there. Which is all that bit that we went through. And that's the main gates. There's the bit over there. There's a path that leads up to there, I think. What is up there? What is that? What is that? It's there. Okay. Is it that? Is that it there? Yes, it is. That big... I thought that was some sort of Colosseum thing. That's a main... That's the this main tower thing. That is where I'm assuming the boss is, quite frankly. Interesting. There has to be a fate over there, right? There has to be a fate over there. I reckon we go and figure out if there's a fate over there. I think we go and try our darndest. One little... One last little jaunt. It's that one there we just put down in the... Yeah, they've gone there. One last jaunt. Okay, that's so far away though. How do we get there? How do we get there? Because there's a swampy bit. Hmm. I am the Onion Knight. Hmm. 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 Um, well, as they always say, fuck around and find out, eh? I wonder if we can... Do you know what? Fuck it. Let's see if we can jump this. Yeah. Oh, we can't. We can't even slightly. Whee! Oh. There appears to be something underneath. That's terrifying. I just thought it would be a dark abyss or a floor, you know. That's weird. There's some sort of weird underneath of it. Some underground terrifying thing. <laughs> Thank you, I'll get my three runes back. I appreciate them. See, there's a fog wall down there. Do you reckon that's a boss? If it is, it'll have a fate. Pensive onion night noises. <laughs> eh, dear. It's all down there. Fuck it, let's go this way. Hang on. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm just stopping and staring for too long. Let's go have a march. Let's go have a wander. <laughs> we'll go back up to this top bit. Uh, which is this way, not that way. I'm so glad that we have a fucking chameleon. Oh god, I hope I get to put that to use. I really do. It's one of my favourite spells, because it's just so silly. You just turn into a tree and slide around as a tree for a bit. It's the best thing ever. It makes me endlessly happy. Oh, dear me. So... Gosh. <laughs> I changed my stream schedule from... Um, from Fall Streams Week to 2. I had a big break as well, and then I went down to two streams a week. And that's about fine. That feels good. That feels like a decent amount. I've done three this week, because I did the whole midnight one last night, saying hello to um, Elden Ring, blah, 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 blah. I'm feeling the exhaustion from it. Genuinely, it sounds so stupid, but genuinely, I'm feeling so tired. Like, fuck. Maybe it's because I've been playing Elden Ring all day as well. That probably has an effect um, in some capacity. I want to get down there. Do I, though? We have a head over to the big thing, which I don't know how to get to. Or we go see this fog wall. I think we go see the fog wall. I want to see what the fog wall has to say for itself. It's all that downstairsy bit there, isn't it? Hmm. Hmm. 
But yeah, gosh, I am, I am, I am tired. I can't wait to go to sleep now. <laughs> Pop. Nice. Give me that fall damage or lack of fall damage, as it were. Um, don't attack me, bird. You're scary, and I don't like you. No offense. See, this leads over here, and that's down there, and that's down there. That's the spooky place, isn't it? Should we go to the spooky place? I don't think I want to, but also it would be an option. I do not know how to get over there. Not for a second. Oh, dear me. Because there's that big pathway that leads down to there. Both of the areas that we have here lead to there. It's on the edge. Because if we go the top way, we can't go any further that way. We go along here, and that leads us to down here with this man that we killed from 10 miles away. If we don't do that, we go into the swampy bit, which leads to a big bit down there and uh, the pathway that goes there behind that, which leads to the front gates, which is that big area there, I think. Yeah, that's the front gate, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Nice. Okay, I'm orienting myself. I'm getting there. So that's the big old tower, which I would love to know if you can get onto the bridge from there. There's the bridge. The old fucker over there. You probably cannot jump over that, but I really hope you can. <laughs> Look, the horse has a double jump. We should use it if we can. So how do we get over there then? Unless that is through the swampy bit. Shall we traverse to the swampy bit real quick? Have a look around. I don't think we're going to be um, reaching any dramatic conclusions on today's stream. I think this is definitely... We're winding into a... Um, just sort of amble around and scout out locations cool down situation you know We've got about half an hour left if we make it that far you know oh dear we're just gonna have a little, a little scooch around a little explorer hello yeah so this is swampland population a whole lot of people there's a door there that leads into the bottom of that church bit i wonder if we can open that up i'll be interested to see Ow. <laughs> okay, so that crossbow that he fired straight in my face didn't hit me. And the sword that I hit straight at his face didn't hit me. So, that didn't hit him even. So, I think we can both just trade that and be like, yeah, no, nothing happened at the end. It was embarrassing for both of us. Let's just pretend it didn't happen. All right, we've explored over that way then. It links up to the front gates, which is both good and bad. Eee, dear. Let's go have a look over here. Yeet. God, that jump is a little bit too close. It's a little bit too scary. Ah, there is a... Ah, that leads to the path. <gasps> no, that leads to that path. Ah, it does link up to here. Okay. <sighs> Look, I don't want to sit here and spam arrows again, because I don't know if I have enough. Hmm. So that's the path from the main gate, which is a dangerous path. You don't want to take it. There's big, big crossbows everywhere. It's sort of... A... Yeah, there's these horrible things everywhere. Where's that? <laughs> not there. Okay. I am not safe. I am not safe. I am not safe. I do not trust myself. So sort of just there, really. <laughs> nope. Wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong way. So, do you reckon that ties into that shortcut there, then? Oh, God, I've gone too far. That big building there. What the fuck is that big building there? Ah, uh, that's the bit with the roofs on it. That's the shortcut. Shortcut. That's the bonfire up in that building there. It's that one there, because we come out to that balcony, don't we? Interesting. I don't know how to get in there, do I? No, I don't. Interesting. Okay. 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 Got the several billion paths to take, and I. What are you? Terrifying. Um. <laughs> God, yeah. There's so many things to choose and do, and I just don't know what to do. I'm at a. I'm at a loss. Um. Yeah, okay. We've got five hundred thingies. We're not here to have a long time. We're here to have a good time. Let's um not heal. But sure, I'll accept to heal. I can probably use the extra health. Pop an assassin's approach. Now let's just go for a wander. Fuck it. Oh, I can see a grace. Oh, shit. Let's go for that. 
I saw you. Don't hide from me. I saw you. <laughs> I think there's a grace in that room. Okay. Going for it. Hello. Would everybody like to politely ignore me? Thank you. It would be of great help. Ooh. Oh, I got a finger. Oh, yeah, it's multiplayer thing. Cool. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was going to be like, ah, you can summon an, enemy, an ally here. No, no, you can you can summon other people. <laughs> Heavens knows why. Oh, my God. There's a fucking thing here. Oh. <laughs> I've never been so happy. Never been so happy. Okay. Well, that gives me a bit more context. That can lead us up to here. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, I feel a bit better now. Why is it you always don't have the rights? I'm guessing this is a one-way door. This is a one-way door. Where does it lead to? Heaven knows. Heaven knows. It's not in the bottom of the church, it looks like. Oh, I'm so fucking glad that we found one of these. Oh, God, another elevator. Oh, we can summon this one. Oh, shit. Normally, if you find an elevator shaft next to a bonfire, it's like a, this will be a shotgun later, but you can't use it right now. Interesting. Hello, where do you come, dear? Let's find out. I love that the fucking elevator looks like a giant door that's just been turned sideways. Where are we? Good luck. <laughs> well, that bodes well, doesn't it? Is this a boss fight? Are we approaching a boss fight? Joy ahead. Mm, that sounds sarcastic. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Excuse me. What? What are you? Why are we fighting pottery? <laughs> what the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Oh, it's one of you. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay. Shh, don't tell him here. Don't tell him here. Yeet. Fuck, 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 There we go, into a corner. Nice. Ooh, Ash of War Stormcaller. Oh, that does. Hello, Pottery. Oh, you are angry, Pottery. I was going to say, will you get annoyed if I go near you? Oh, ah! I apologize if that was loud. I have just been terrified by a giant spinning bowl of death. What, and I repeat, what the actual fuck is that? <sighs> Hello. Why do you exist? No offense, but why do you exist? <gasps> what is that? Whose idea was that? Who was like, I have a great idea that will fit the fantasy of our Elden Ring castle shenaniganry? Pottery that has legs and spins. I mean, I do not hate it. I honestly love it. I just do not know where. Living Josh? Ah, raw meat dumpling. I'm disgusted. Great. Okay. <laughs> Whose idea was this? His brain comes up with living pottery. A genius, that's who. Clearly. Oh, God, I'm out of magic juice. Oh, well. It's pottery. What could possibly go wrong? Everything. Everything can and will go wrong. I don't like that they jump, that they drop. Beware of monstrosity. A fair thing. Thank you for that one. Bit late. I didn't read that too, too, too soon. I enjoy that they're pretty cracked part. Oh no. I enjoy that as long as I don't come into this area, they won't try and kill me. Cracked part. Nice. I can use this for consumables. Um, that's fun. If not terrifying. Oh, good heavens. Right, let's go uh, heal back up from that situation. We are out of magic juice. We are out of everything. We shall go heal. God, I haven't explored that area, that swampy bit. I need to do that at some point. And now that we are at this side of it and we have a spawn point at this side of it, there's definitely more room to do that. Uh, I'm very glad. Gosh, I feel like I'm missing all this. <sighs> wow. I think it's partly because it's so open world, but also... I 
don't know. I feel like I'm, I, I'm missing so much stuff. Like, there's so much of the level I've just not touched yet. So where does the giant pot come from? Do you know what? Let's not think about it. Let's just presume nowhere. Let's just not think about the giant pottery ever again. It exists not. There's an item down here. Oh, easy. Nice. Ooh. Can we jump that? Oh, I don't know if we can. I can look at it with a spy glass. Not what I meant to do, but I go. Oh, we can't jump that, but can we? Yeah. Oh, video game. Video game. You teach me well. You teach me well. Ah, oh, God, the fucking... The freedom to jump and climb on ledges. Thank you. This game. This game is treating me like no other game. I adore it. It's all the things I've wanted to do in a Souls-like game before, you know? It's all of the, like, oh, I wish we could climb on the castle ledges. Oh, I wish we could go on that rooftop. I wish we could do all these little weird things. Now you fucking can. Could this be a ladder? It does look like a ladder, doesn't it? Yes. Regrettably, no. <laughs> Could this be an item? No. Just a sign. Oh. Oh, we're above the pottery. <laughs> we're above the pottery. Yep. Mm -hmm. No, I said what I said. Smithing stones. We love to see it. Give me some upgrades. Where the fuck are we now? I didn't even... I didn't think this was an accessible area. There are so many... Areas. There's so many things to do. So many places to go. I've just picked up a lily. And there's a message to read. Time for flower. Yep, that was a flower. What does this one say? If only I had a head. Mm. Smithing stone. Golem runes. Wow. <laughs> Be wary of right. Oh. There's an enemy there. <gasps> there's an enemy there as well. You bugger. Come on the shoes. Oh no. Where are we now? I don't know. <laughs> Likely ambush. Yeah, it feels like it, doesn't it? Feels like it. Are we oh, God, where are you? I saw you. <laughs> Come on. Ch children. Oh, fine. Flame sling it is. You Wow, okay, that's good stuff. That's good stuff. I should use my flame-based stuff way more often. Oh god, there's like three of them down there. One. That's a barrel. Sadly not an explosive one. Otherwise that would have been amazing. Oh, that was supposed to be a plunge attack. It was just too sad to be a plunge attack. No, I don't feel like plunging. Okay, that's okay, I guess. You don't have to. No pressure. Shield! Uh -huh. Oh, is there a shield on the thing? Saucy. I wonder if it's good. Ah, blocking. Oh, shit. Mana tower shield. I wonder if that's good for, like, blocking those giant ballista things. Visions of calmness. It does look nice and calm out there, doesn't it? Oh, wow. Surely what you seek is somewhere close by. Smithing stone. God, where are we? We're at this side now. <gasps> That's the place where we started. That's where we started the game. Where we got insta-killed and teleported back to um, the other place. That's that bit. I figured we'd come back to there at some point. It looks like we have to get teleported there, though, to be fair. So this isn't a player left message. This is... Well, it looks like that wizard that we've spoken to before. What you seek is somewhere nearby. There's a jumpy offy bit over here. Can we make that? Like, can we walk on that ledge? Let's find out. We can make it. We possibly also could walk on that ledge if I named it better, but oh well. Good heavens. Good heaven. I I'm I don't want to know, but I am desperate to find out through my own playing how big this game is. Like, thank you. <laughs> like, how much of this game is... I, like, I, there'll be loads of big open areas that aren't as in-depth and big and 
fun and rich to explore. I mean, it'd be wonderful to explore, but, you know, different vibe compared to this. Not every area will be like this castle. I understand that for a fact. But, like, try too handy. Well. <laughs> um, uh, no, not read the map. I want to pick up the item. Why? What? But there we go. Got the room. Have I been over there? I have, I think. Yes. <gasps> yes, that's when I dropped down and went down there, and that's where the scary night is. This game is fucking amazing. Holy shit, it's huge. There's so much to it. That's where we are. No, it isn't. I don't know. It's somewhere. An item there. Rainbow stone. Where the fuck are we now? Where the Anna Londo are we now? <laughs> oh, good lord, it's this door here. Yay. Oh, you love to see it. You fucking love to see it. Oh, wow. That's good shit right there. That's good shit right there. <laughs> I really like that. Wow. Yeah, I am terrified to find out, but also very, very... I want to find out how big this game is. Be wary of enemy. It's right there. Or are we going to just knock it off by jumping? No. <laughs> this game is huge and wonderful and there's a... That's not the right button. <laughs> there's a bat staring at me. Oh, I'm sorry, friend. I'm not sorry. Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. <laughs> Love how huge this game is, though. Seriously, it's so fucking good. Oh, poor little bat having time on the floor. Well, thankfully, that looks like a dead end over there, which is weirdly makes me happy. Um. <laughs> oh dear me. So that doesn't look like anywhere we can go or should go. That does it down there, however. We can get to that from there. Let's head back up here then. God, just the freedom of movement paired with the wonderful, messy, delightful, explorey times. Dog ahead. That's a bat. Unless there is a dog. No, that's just a bat. <laughs> Bats, dogs, it's all the words. Kind of. They're all. It's a bird fiend. And see, that's not even just a pit into nothingness. That is just a location. Like, that's somewhere down there that we can go and actually maybe end, we'll end up going. Like, ah. this is a whole nother level. This is a whole nother level. It really is. Oh. Hello, bat. I'd like to shoot you, please. Can I have your room? Can I have you with me to be shot, please? Thank you. No. Okay. I understand. I understand. Look, everyone gets nervous about it. First time being shot and all that. It's okay. I'm here to help. Plunging attack. <laughs> More like swiping mid-air attack. But hey, huh? Oh. Try mimicry. Okay. <laughs> I'm a tree. Did we want to try a different mimicry? Oh, I'm a statue. Da, da, da. <laughs> Good message. Means nothing. Good message. Do, 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 do. Actually, to be fair, being a mimic, you move a lot slower. It's a, it's a good way to make sure you are able to control your movement. Enemy ahead. Where? Oh, good lord. There's, an air, there's a platform up there. How on earth do you get up? There. Maybe you don't. There's a message, but it doesn't look like there's anything else over there. Oh god, there's an I am all the way up there. The fuck is that? <laughs> Good heavens. Alright, down we go. Do 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 I didn't press the right button. There you go. I wanna go home. Me too, it's very stressful. <laughs> In a wonderful way. Oh my god, there's so much. There's just so much. 
Try attacking the wall. No. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, we can teleport out of here if needed. And we have unlocked a shabadabafib. <laughs> yep, no, those were words. Um, there's a rat. Oh my god, there's a rat. Oh, this game has rats. <laughs> no more excited to see a rat in my entire life. Hey, dear. Oh, wow. Those are Dark Souls rats. That's the most Dark souls -y rat. That, that, it doesn't even look like a different model. Oh, I wouldn't blame it if it wasn't. Honestly, why bother making a different rat? You got your iconic rats. 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 We are the rats. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> something, something rats. Hello, little friends. I love Dark Souls rats. They're huge and terrifying and squinky. Oh my god, how did you get up here? Excuse me, they can jump? Who the fuck gave rats the right to jump? Rats did not earn this. Oh my god, oh my god. Ah, you're not going to kill me when I'm down here. Surely that's just mean. I can kill rats. I will not be, I will not be killed by rats. Ah. God. It's just, it's so... Ah, there's a platform here. Can we go up? No. <laughs> okay. It's so delightful. <laughs> rat a rat. Just having the familiarity of like, this is a Dark Souls rat. This is a FromSoft rat. Like, they're all, this is how they behave. This is how they attack. And it's reliable. They're always like that. Like, head. <laughs> ah. Expect you to. Ah! Hello! They were right. There's a rat. Oh, rat's on fire. Boink. I still have one more magic flask. That's good. Boink. There we go. Hello, big friend. You are wonderful, you are. In a terrifying sort of way. Yeah, that's, I think that's the most scared I've ever been of a giant rat in Dark Souls. Or in a Frostnoft game. That's wonderful. That's absolutely wonderful. <laughs> Why do I find it wonderful that I'm scared by a rat? <laughs> Poison blue. I can hear a sparkly thing. Oh, you're a magic one. Get here, you bugger. You're gonna give me a magic flask back. Yay, nice. Oh, no, you're not. Oh, are, are you? Rancral. That a spell? Shit, have I just got a new spell? And by that, do I... <laughs> what I mean is, have I just got a magic spell? Oh, thank you for the jump location. That's wonderful. Because, uh, I don't have magic. <laughs> not very smart. I want to. I love all spellcasting and video games, but like, you know. I, I'm a faithy person at the moment. I need to, I haven't even got a staff to cast spells. First off a head. Oh, shit. Look at that. There's so many items in there. That has to be some sort of trap, right? What even is that? There's a big thing. So many roots and trees. That must be a boss. That has to be a boss. Surely. Oh, hello, Flicky. You're back. <laughs> How was the walk of the dog? I've been marveling at rats. It's not been very um, <laughs> informative in any way. This must be a boss pit. There's... There's... There's only... There's one blood stain down there. Are you evil, Skelet? Oh, excuse me. Just gonna fiddle with my um, nothingness arrows there. No. <laughs> Pop goes the pile of skulls. That... Has to be a boss area, surely. I don't want to go in there and lose my 2000. Ah, it's only 2000. <laughs> 2000 going on. Be in the awkward weather where during days it's really warm, so snow melts to become wet. Then during night it goes minus again and all freezes, so you're walking on ice. Oh gosh, I know that. Yeah, I know that weather. We don't get it super, super often, but I know exactly what you mean. That's, yeah. It's stressful times. It's stressful times because you're almost sort of half not expecting it, but it's this weird combination of like. Yeah, it's real dangerous. And what the fuck is that? Well, I'm dying down here, folks. Um, it's been a lovely stream. Fucking hell, that's her. Ow. Any way I can run. Any, any running situation we can do here. I'd love it if there was. I'm not sure. Oh, what the hell is that? Very good question. Um, <laughs> not a fucking clue. Terrifying. Terrifying. Fuck. Ugh. 
There appears to be a melted creature there. Oh, there's a ladder right there. Fuck. <laughs> there's a ladder right there. Oh. <laughs> oh, well, it was only 2,000. It's not the biggest number. Well, then, that was terrifying. However, I think that was an appropriate end for now. <laughs> I'm going to pop the stream there. Oh, look at us. Aren't we gorgeous? <laughs> not to toot my own heart, but toot toot. I did a wonder with the character design. Goodness gracious me. Wow. Thank you for streaming, Prince Roll. Thank you for being here. It was absolutely delightful. Oh, wow. I can't wait to shoot that thing with 50 arrows from afar. <laughs> Look, maybe in 10 years' time, when I get comfortable with this game, I will not be doing that. I'll be running in and killing things. But, I, you know, this isn't Dark Souls 3. This is a brand new scary game. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Thank you, Sunstone, for all the abuse. Poor Sunstone has been through a lot, and they're going to go through even more before this is all done, so they better get used to it. <laughs> all right. Thank you all for watching. Take care of yourselves, um, and I will see you next week. Next Tuesday, I think. Yeah. Okay. You're all wonderful people. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.